How's the royal family? I pray that everyone is doing well. Yes, my royal family. The title is True, Real, and Correct. So, on this endless list of things that black people can't do in America, now it's a problem barbecuing while black. It is such a great problem that some white people in America, and I know that white people are listening to it, some, not all, but I know y'all not going to hear the not all, feel compelled to call law enforcement on black people when they barbecue in undesignated areas. It is such a great crime that they feel the need to call the police. So I'm going to hold it right there. But this story gets much, much deeper. Seriously ugly. Police were called in because of a dispute about where people can set up their charcoal grill. But as Crown Forest Hazik Madhun reports, who is right and who is wrong could be a lesson in community civility and use of resources. This is exactly what's the problem with Oakland today. This, this, this lady right here wants to sit here and call the police on them for having a barbecue at the lake as if this is not normal. You are listening to the voice of Michelle Snyder. She is using her cell phone to record the woman you see here in this video who called Oakland police because... Uh, it's illegal to have a charcoal grill in the park here. The incident happened a couple of weeks ago here at Lake Merritt in Oakland. Michelle Snyder's husband, Kenzie Smith, says he and a friend were setting up for a weekend cookout like they have done for decades with their families when he says they were approached by the woman you see in the video. She said that uh, we were trespassing, we were not welcome um, and then she turned back around and then like she she was like y'all going to jail yeah I think we need to question the policies that have made this uh, this woman feel like she was in a right to harass people according to this official Oakland Park and Recreations map of Lake Merritt there are six designated barbecue locations three stationary charcoal locations and three non charcoal portable grill locations. The Oakland couple were charcoal grilling in a non-charcoal grilling location. I've seen people barbecue with charcoal uh, for years, and I've never known it to be a, a distraction or a problem. It is against the rules, but is it a crime? It's really incumbent upon all of us to make sure that when we are calling police, it's for emergency purposes. Oakland City Council member Lynette Gibson McElhaney suggests other options instead of calling the police in this situation. So I want to encourage people to know when to call police, when to raise a question or regulation with the city council. Maybe there's a passive way to reach out to us. Oakland mayoral candidate Cat Brooks looks at the scenario from a different angle. When you engage law enforcement in these kinds of things, you are opening the door for things going very wrong. You are opening the door for the potential of arrest, right? Like we saw what happened in, in Philadelphia with those two black men. Or worse, you're opening the door for physical assault and or death. And, and, and I don't believe in this day and age that white folks don't know that. Oakland police did arrive. Both parties claimed they were being harassed. Officers took a police report, no citations given, and no arrest. Smith was allowed to continue his weekend family barbecue by the lake like he has since he was a child. I want some kind of awareness to be, you know what I'm saying, like we need to be able to talk about this in an open forum. And if that happens, it could be the beginning of building a better community. In Oakland, Hazik Madhun, Crime for New. All right, my royal family, this is a local story. And I need to start um, reporting more local stories. So, I said it gets much deeper. So what happens, my royal family? This woman calls the cops and wait two hours. And she gets agitated. Now, she makes sure she's around them for two hours while they are barbecuing. And this is such a crime that it gets under her skin because they did not arrive um, immediately to arrest 
or even possibly kill the back black family for barbecuing in an undesignated area. It is such a crime. It, it's that big of a crime to her. So then what she does is the white lady who was married to one of the black ladies start to film her and then she commits a crime, the white lady does, who call the police, and snatch the white lady's um, ATM card. Now we resume the story. And I'll just let it play itself out. Because I didn't want to play the entire video. Now check this out. Nobody is touching you. Nobody's bothering you. You're the one that came at us. You're the one that sat there for two hours being mean to some two black men because they're barbecuing. That's what's really um, going on. I am going to be inside the quick stop at Brooklyn oh, Avenue yeah, and Lake Mer Merritt here. Avenue. Can you give me my card back? You think I can't keep asking for this? Can you give me my card back? Please leave me alone. This woman just stole my card. Hello? And she's calling black men to get them arrested, but she's stealing my property. I'm sorry if I'm bothering you. I do apologize. I wish you would just give me the card back so I can leave her alone. You know what I mean? She stole my property because she wants to dox a black man for barbecuing at Lake Merritt. And now she doesn't want to give me the card back. She wants to harass people and she doesn't want harassment to happen to her. And then she comes into this establishment to act like a victim and bother them, like she didn't do anything wrong. They're not coming for you? No, there he is right there. I don't know why you are scared. I'm not touching you. <laughs> Leave me alone. <clears throat> Can I have my card back? 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 I'm being harassed. Okay. Can you back I off? I like her, her <laughs> yes. card that she's yes. me. Can you back off? Yeah, sure. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm at the quick stop. <laughs> Ma'am, can you just back up yeah. just a tad so I can talk to her? Thank yeah, you. Sure. <laughs> She stole my card and I wanted it back. I, I did not tell her. I, I have witnesses. Okay, you see how important that was? Now she did that old fake ass crying. All that fake ass crying. She stole the white lady's ATM card out of her hand. She was a part of the barbecue. Then when the barbie, then when the police officer pull up, she got to be more dramatic, but she made damn sure she's going to show the law enforcement this is the law. This is the designated area for black people to barbecue. See, white America know exactly what they are doing. And for some reason, 
and I know the reason and I'm not going to give up the reason y'all have to come to the hangout tomorrow for some reason there is a great deal of hyperbia now around black folks doing anything so when I say the endless list the never ending list even thinking while black even being black being born black I could sit up here for hours and any reason that a racist white person could come up with to call law enforcement and then when you see somebody like this woman who don't get her way who wait two two hours then it's time to escalate it and say people are harassing her people are putting their hand on her we ain't that stupid we know we being watched that's the part that y'all do not know we know we being watched we know what system we are under we know your psychosis then you come on this channel when you hear core ass truth and i don't put no cut on it and say i'm an angry black woman or why you got to bring race in it leave us the fuck alone that's all I can say because it's going to be that one black person that you encounter that ain't going to be so nice that ain't going to give a fuck that's going to go the fuck off on you and it ain't going to be no recourse this is ridiculous but this will continue because y'all are the gift that keep giving you are the one showing the world who you really is so anyway my royal family I will post the entire video. It's not two hours. It's about 25 minutes or so. Um, if you want to watch the entire video of how ridiculous this is. Now, barbecuing while black in an undesignated area is such a major crime. Either you can get arrested or killed. That is the only recourse when law enforcement deals with the royal family. So anyway, my royal family... Render your voice with your beautiful divine words. And as always, my royal family, I thank you for your love. I thank you for your support. And with that said, Ashe, this is some ridiculous ass shit. Ridiculous.